हेलो गाइस वेलकम बैक टू सेवन इंजीनियरिंग यूट्यूब चैनल प्लीज सब्सक्राइब और चैनल फॉर डेली सेवन इंजीनियरिंग वेजेस इन टुडे लेक्चर वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट द कार्टेलमेंट ऑफ बार्स इन द बीम्स सो व्हाट इज मीन बाय कार्टेलमेंट ऑफ बार्स आई विल एक्सप्लेन दिस विद द हेल्प ऑफ द एग्जांपल हियर वी सी हियर अ फ्रेम स्ट्रक्चर व्हिच इज द कॉम्बिनेशन ऑफ द टू कॉलम्स इन वन बीम सो इन दिस लेक्चर वी विल टॉक अबाउट हाउ वी कार्टेल द बार्स और वी कट द बार्स कार्टेलमेंट ऑफ बार्स मीन कटिंग ऑफ द बार्स so so why we do curtailment of the bars or why we do cutting of the bars in the beam because we want to do the economical design of the beam we want to save some money so we do curtailment of the bars in the beams because if we have multi story building like 100 floors or 80 floors so we do curtailment of the bars in beam in order to save the money in each beam and we have thousands of beams in our structure so we can save millions of monies and just a simple a structure consists of the 100 floors or 80 floors so it's very important to do the curtailment of the bars in the structures where there are hundreds of beams or thousands of beam in the building so now how do this curtailment works in a beam so for example if i consider this is a beam and there is an uniformly distributed load acting on the beam for example this is w any load in kilonewton per meter is acting on this beam so due to this load the beam will try to bend and will show some bending stresses so because it is a flexure member so it will always shows the flexure or bending stresses so the beam bends like in this way and if i draw it correctly so it will show some stresses like in this way so where we will have some negative here we will have some positive bending moment and here we will have negative bending moment at the extreme of the beam so we always provide reinforcement in the beam in the region where we have bending moment because reinforcement is always used to take the bending stresses or bending moment so in beam we provide here if i draw it with a different color so we provide here reinforcement here in the beam but we want to cut out the reinforcement at the bottom because we see here the rein, the bending moment is extreme only at this position and there is no such bending moment here or very small value here at this region so that's why we want to cut out the bar and the beam in this region so this is known as the curtailment of the bars so we provide only the bar in some region to take only the bending stresses where they are maximum so if i show it with this diagram it will be more clear here so my beam bends and we want to provide our bars only in certain region according to the standards for example in this lecture i'm going to focus on the aci standards so they mention that if this is the total length of the beam l for example is 10 meter then you have to cut out the bottom bars here only here should be l by 8 i mean the bar should not be extend till to the extreme of the column here but it should be cut out l by 8 from the both edges and also l by 8 here so l by 8 means if i divide this total length l is 10 meter divide by 8 this is l by 8 so i got 1.25 meter so it means at 1.25 meter i don't have to extend my bar i have to cut out the bars and only provide in this region so this is this is what i mean by curtailment of the bars in the beam similarly we have negative bending moment at the extreme edges so we provide the reinforcement only here at the extreme edges at the here like in this way in order to take the negative bending moments in the beam here is the steel bar so according to the aci it mentioned that this bar should only be extended till to the l by 3 here the bar should only be extended till to the l by 3 now l is 10 meter here dividing by 3 so we got 0.33 something meter here as well 0.33 something meter so it means that the steel bars here at the bottom at the top of the beam should be extended only to the l by 3 meter or we can say l by 3 here we got 0.33 meter if the total length of the beam is 10 meter 
because we don't have here if I show you with a different color here we don't have any negative bending movement that's why we don't need to provide the bars in this region so we can save our money in uh, doing the curtainment of the bars here we also don't have bending movement here also we don't have bending movement so we just cut the uh, bars in order to only take the tension forces are the bending moment only at those region where they are maximum or they are higher. So hope you guys understood and don't forget to subscribe our channel for daily civil engineering videos. Thank you for watching our video.